Hi, I'm Jane Applegate with CBTV. I'm very happy to be here today with Nicole Riley. She's the state director for the NFIB, which is the National Federation for Independent Business. Thanks for coming in, Nicole. Great. Thanks for having me, Jane. So first, tell us, what does NFIB do for the business owners that you represent? Sure. We are actually an advocacy group on behalf of small business owners, so we're their voice um, in Richmond, um, both in front of the General Assembly and in front of the executive branch, the governor. So we advocate advocate on their behalf on issues that impact small businesses. And because we're focused on providing resources for Virginia business sure. owners, what does a member benefit from if they join NFIB? Oh, sure. Well, one, um, we offer, we offer mem member benefits that range from doing things like webinars that will give tips on, you know, the best time practices um, for social marketing, how to engage a CPA to help with your taxes. Uh, we also do offer member benefits in the way of um, sort of buying power in the sense that if you're a member, you can get a discount through FedEx and other type of other business services that you might need. And because you're being able to pull together resources that we have been able to, to leverage good prices and discounts for our members. And how many members do you have in the state of Virginia? We have approximately 6,000 members across the Commonwealth, um, and they range from all different um, parts of the Commonwealth, from far southwest to Hampton Roads, northern Virginia. And what would you say are the top issues facing Virginia business owners? Sure. Um, well, certainly coming out of this economy has been uh, their number one concern, and so we've um, really tried to advocate for policies that are going to keep taxes low for them and also give them a lot of certainty. And that's certainly one of the things that they need um, when they're trying to plan and, and, and think about expanding their business is to have certainty. And are there um, issues that the legislature is dealing with that, that our viewers should know about? Healthcare reform. So we have been engaged on that front um, in the states. There's the health benefits exchange that would be created. And this is supposed to be like a new marketplace where small business owners and individuals who have to buy health insurance can go and try to pull together uh, their resources and hopefully get more affordable health insurance. So we're part of the process, just the planning phase. And would you say overall that Virginia is a good place to open a small business? Absolutely. I, I hear from my members all the time in Virginia that they're so happy they do business in Virginia. Um, in fact, I had a member just last week, she's in the office supply business and has colleagues in other parts of the country and she says they just aren't facing the same um, uh, environment, good, good business-friendly environment that we have here in Virginia. Nicole, that was great information. Thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you for having me. I'm Jane Applegate with CBTV.